doing a YouTube channel from scratch and it's gonna be zero advertising. And I apologize for all this confusing mess over here that nobody uses it. It's all like right out of the Beautiful Mind movie. Um, but anyways, zero advertising YouTube channel. It's a brand new channel. And we're gonna call it Manuel Suarez Marketing. Manuel Suarez Marketing. And I have this, an episodical strategy in which I'm going to launch four videos a week. And I'm gonna start somewhere around beginning of February. I'm now recording the content and getting everything set up for that. But what I was explaining to Jimmy here is that every single video is a product. Just like you're gonna launch a new product for your brand, when you're launching a video, it has to be, it has to be analyzed in detail. And it has to be like thought through in detail, just like you would a product before you launch it, like any product. You know, I don't have a product next to me here, but in the Natural Slim brand, when we are coming up with a new formula, it's very, very detailed. It's a, you, you get a lot of like processes and systems and questions and a lot of stuff. Every single one of these things, like, so we got a YouTube channel and it is a discovery channel in which people are gonna find you because they're looking for information. That's what YouTube is there for, right? It's like your, ability, your opportunity to show them that you're valuable and you get information. But inside a video, there's all these different sections. And Jimmy, you gotta, like, you're gonna run this project, you gotta know that all these sections are on their own extremely important, right? So you got a thumbnail. I've heard that people like Hormosi, by the way, like Alex Hormosi, if you are living above uh, sea level, you know who he is. He spends tens of thousands of dollars with the designers and the graphics and the editors and the, the, the artists and everybody else to come up with the perfect thumbnail because that earns the click. The title, the title in, in the YouTube uh, world is, has to be a combination of two things. You're trying to talk to the algorithm while at the same time talking to the human being performing the search. Both things have to happen at the same time. The algorithm is going to show you to audiences that are looking for your content. Without the algorithm, you get no help. People would have to find you with direct links and by luck. And we don't want that. Like in my YouTube channel with my father, 60% of every single video watch is from this thing called Discovery. It's, it, it's, it's, it's YouTube introducing me and my father's content to audiences, right? So this is very important. So the title will help you get discovered. Tags help you get discovered. The content itself has to be far through. It has a beginning, it has to be an end. I usually tell people, stay within a four minute to 12 minute range. Uh, the intros, like you gotta go straight to the point. What are they going to watch? Remember, it's a world that attention span is getting smaller and smaller every single day, which means that you have a second or two to capture their attention. So you gotta go straight to the point. And then the outro, the outro is an opportunity to introduce them to other content, to playlists, to more information about your brand, to connect them with your world at a deeper level because these people got to the end of that video. These are the more qualified people to now introduce them to something else because they actually sat down and watched an entire piece of content. So I'm gonna do this four times a week, four times a week. I'm gonna spend zero dollars in advertising and I'm gonna put my head down and do it for a full year, brand new channel. And I wanna see what happens in the year 2024 to see if we can make this channel take off without zero advertising, just with me giving my value, my education, my inspiration, my marketing content, whatever it is, to try to get this content to take off. I'm gonna be talking about basics of marketing. What is marketing? What are all the marketing terms? Social media opportunities, how to advertise, the senior strategies on social media, everything that we do here at Attention Grabbing Media. I'm gonna talk about all of that. But if all these elements, and this is for you, Jimmy, recording the video, if all these elements are not carefully thought through, every single one of them, it's all gonna bomb. It doesn't matter what my content does. It doesn't matter how good it is. These things need to be very powerful also. And you gotta, like, that's why I'm doing like, I'm not launching a video until I get 10 videos recorded. And I'm gonna keep on recording them because I want you to ensure that you don't have this rush to publish a video. 
because you're running out of content. You have to have a cushion. You have to have more than enough. So that way you really analyze what you're doing because you're launching a product, AKA a video. And this video has one opportunity to capture attention via the algorithm and the audiences that are discovering your content. If you miss that opportunity, it's gone. And now good luck trying to get people to watch that content. Thumbnail, title, tags, content, intro, outro. That is the formula for a successful YouTube video, AKA YouTube product, and for a successful growth, successful growth of a YouTube channel. So watch, let's see what happens with it. This is right now, what is it, Jimmy? January 4th? January 3rd? January 3rd, something like that. Yeah. We're starting the year. This is a big part of what I'm gonna do this year. And uh, I'm gonna put a team together. It should be like, Four people that are a part of this project, by the way, four people. I got myself coming up with the content ideas and recording it. I got Jimmy recording the, and the cameras and Joe working on the cameras too. And then we got a, maybe an editor or two here and there. And other than that, off we go. Let's see what happens at the end of 2024. Let's roll. That's the plan.